Yang terhormat Bapak Abri Eko Nuryanto from the Ministry of Youth and Sports ya. Ibu Anggi Timur, uh, the President of AIA, uh, Australian Capital Territory. Ibu Ayu Dwi Adi Susanti, AIEP 2015, Professor Greg Philly from ANU, and Director of Universitas Pendidikan Nasional in Denpasar, para peserta Virtual Youth Forum, baik yang berada di Indonesia maupun Australia, Distinguished Guests, Ladies and Gentlemen. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Namo Buddhaya Salam sejahtera Bagi kita semuanya Selamat pagi A very good morning to all of you It is such a great honor For me to join you At the opening of the Virtual Youth Forum With the theme The role of youth In strengthening The bilateral relations Between Indonesia and Australia It is also a great honor for me uh, to represent the Embassy of the Republic of Indonesia in Canberra in this forum. Unfortunately, due to the global pandemic, this program has to be carried out virtually. Otherwise, actually, it is good if we can meet physically sometimes in the near future. But nevertheless, I believe that the spirit of learning and the spirit of gaining more knowledge uh, as, well as, as well as experience will keep us in a good mindset of positivity while participating in this program. Especially this morning, seeing all the participants uh, who has the full passion and energy somehow I feel that I'm young again. Bapak-bapak, ibu-ibu, saudara-saudari sekalian, all uh, my friends here, this initiative is a true testament that the good relations between Indonesia and Australia are on the level uh, of uh, good relations. This program will definitely enrich each of us, everybody of us, the personal advancement, networking, knowledge, and experience. Many programs have been organized between Indonesia and Australia, like IAP, IA, IMAP, Dharma Siswa, BSBI, and etc. Those projects are the valuable projects that support the youth vision that our two countries believe in. As the youth of today hold the potential and the power to shape the future. The youth are both the leaders of the future and also the agents of change of the present. The youth are the voices that can reject hatred conflict, suspicion, discord, and mistrust. And the youth are the voices that can sow peace, cooperation, and harmony. The existence of these vibrant groups of young Indonesians and Australians have shown that the youth are the representation of a peace future as well as the hope of our countries relations. Therefore, in this opportunity, I would like to share with you that the government of Indonesia and also the government of Australia through uh, DFAT or in Indonesia through Kementerian Luar Negeri have become our main partner, our main agents of change in running the exchange program that has proven to be effective medium to promote a better cross-cultural understanding among the youth of our two countries. 
Bapak-bapak, ibu-ibu, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, people to people contact, including the youth exchange program, is indeed and will always become one of the cornerstones of Indonesia and Australia bilateral relations. Today we are witnessing a very special group of young and bright Indonesians and Australians like yourself who are about to embark a wonderful yet challenging journey after the two countries have signed the uh, important agreement which is called AYASEPA. AYASEPA has came into force on the 5th of July 2020 and AYASEPA is not about economic cooperation only it is also related to people to people contacts and people to people links that all of us the young generation can take part in this important agreement you are the face of indonesia and you are the face of the bilateral relations between indonesia and australia in the future as for the Australian participants, I hope that through this program you will learn a lot about uh, Indonesian rich cultures, traditions, values, Bahasa Indonesia directly from your Indonesian friends. And it is also the best opportunity for you to share your cultures as well to Indonesian friends. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, and all the participants, the last but not least, I hope this program could inspire you to make your own contribution to the betterment of Indonesia and Australia. And I hope as young generation can take advantage from IASEPA. I fervently hope that every one of us will foster a great trust, contribute to the better relations between Indonesia and Australia. Terima kasih and thank you very much and I hope uh, you can take advantage, uh, enjoy the webinar organized by Universitas Pendidikan Nasional in Bali. Thank you.